Earlier in the lesson, we looked at an electric circuit with a D-cell battery and a light bulb that used direct current. With direct current, electrons flow through a wire much like water flows through a hose. The electricity flows directly through the entire circuit. An electric current can also be produced in another way called alternating current. With alternating current, electrons quickly move back and forth within the wire. As long as the electrons are continually moving, an electric current exists. The electrical outlets in your home and school supply alternating current. Let's look at how alternating current is generated.